Okay, hi everybody. For this question right here, we're told that a pendulum swings through an arc of 45 degrees. Now, if I'm going to be using my my uh, arc length formula here, this this theta equals a r, I know right away here that that's got to be converted into into uh, radians here. So my theta here at 45 degrees, okay, uh, is going to end up being pi over four radians. That's a pretty standard one. So that's that's pretty easy. So find the length of the pendulum, so we're looking for the radius in this case, if the end of the pendulum swings through an arc of 32 centimeters. Okay, well the formula here is theta is equal to AR, and I'm looking for, for R here. So I can swap the theta and the R, and get that R is equal to A over theta. Actually, this becomes a, a fairly easy little, little substitution here. This is going to be 32 divided by pi over 4. Okay, and I might go to my calculator here because I'm going to get a pi in there. So let's let the calculator handle that. So this will be 32 divided by, and in brackets, I want to put brackets around this so that the calculator knows the order of operations here, pi divided by 4. I'm going to get 40.7. So the radius here is 40.7. Oh, and it says to the nearest centimeter. So it's approximately that, and actually we can do a little bit better then, because it says to the nearest centimeter, so this will be approximately 41 centimeters.